Hey, welcome back to Bonapa. But today we are going to prepare a delicious and beautiful, stunning, beautiful zucchini and carrot tart. It's a super easy recipe with a final, surprising, beautiful final effect. It's super kids friendly, but it's also perfect for any party you're going to give because I'm sure your guests will be surprised by the final result of this beautiful and yummy tart. Let's start from the beginning. First thing to do, we're going to preheat the oven at 350 degrees. We're going to take the puff pastry this is the easy way. Of course, you can prepare your own pie dough, but I think that the puff pastry is perfect and it's super easy for this recipe. I'm going to unroll my puff pastry on a flat surface. I'm going to take a tart pan, a big one, and I'm going to cover my pan with the puff pastry. Then I will take a tiny piece of parchment paper, I will place it in the center, and I will put some kind of weight, like seeds, beans, in the center, so that the parchment paper will stay down. I'm going to bake my pie base in the oven for 15-20 minutes. Basically, I want the tart crust to get nice and golden. Meanwhile, I will prepare the filling. I'm going to beat the eggs in a nice big bowl, and then I'm going to add the ricotta cheese, the grated parmesan cheese. I will also grate some nutmeg. The nutmeg will give a nice taste to the final tart, and I really like it. I will adjust with some salt, and then I will add the mozzarella chopped in cubes and the fresh oregano directly from my garden. The puff pastry is cooked, I'm going to remove it from the oven and I'm going to let it cool down for a while. It's time to prepare the vegetables, that's the fun part. Today I was lucky, I found very colored zucchini and carrots. I found yellow, orange and purple carrots and yellow and green zucchini perfect for this recipe. With the potato peeler or with the mandolin, I'm going to slice for the length my vegetables. I want a very, very thin slice. I'm going to place everything in a bowl and I'm going to microwave my vegetables for one minute. This is a secret to make the vegetables easier to handle. I'm going to take one long slice of zucchini and I'm going to roll the zucchini on itself, creating a kind of core. I'm going to take another slice and, I will, and I'm going to roll this slice on the outside. And slowly, with three or four slices, I will form a nice rose. The puff pastry is cooled down. It's time to pour our ricotta and egg mix in the center and spread it nicely. Then I'm going to place my zucchini rose right in the center of my tart and I will keep going creating different roses of different colors and I will place them one next to the other creating a nice and beautiful zucchini and carrot field. Final touch, I will place two, three tablespoons of extra virgin olive oil in a cup and with a kitchen brush, I will brush the surface of my tart. The oven is already preheated at 380 degrees. I'm going to bake my zucchini and carrot tart for 50 minutes. And voila! Our zucchini and carrot field of roses is beautiful and ready to be enjoyed. This is a perfect kids-friendly recipe to serve in order to impress your friends with a super easy recipe with their stunning, beautiful result. I really hope you are going to enjoy this recipe like we did. It's perfect for a potluck party or just to impress your kids. <laughs> and we are going to see each other next week with another recipe from Bonapappa. And as always, Bonapappa! Papa tutti, ciao!